Have you guys ever wanted to create your own Discord and especially for your NFT collection, then you clicked on the right video because today we are going over the whole NFT Discord creation process and I am going to show you some different kinds of things um, you absolutely need for the Discord and how to make it look really, really nice. Of course, your server is yours, so you don't need to follow this guide step by step and you can, you know, do whatever you want. But I hope this tutorial will help you out a lot. Okay, so let's begin with starting your server. What you need for that is obviously Discord, uh, a Discord account. So you can just go to Discord, open it on the web, or if you have it, have the app, then you can just open that and log in, and you should be right uh, there. Okay. When you are logged in, man, I got a lot of messages. Don't mind that though. When you are logged in, we will go down here where it says create server. And there we are just basically going to click the plus sign. And then we are going to uh, don't mind it. It's on German right now, but it's the exact same thing on English too. So don't mind that. Then we just go on create, uh, like, I don't know what it says for you. Just create the new server on your own. And then you're just going to click for community. Then you are already able to choose a server main. And I'm just going to name this one test right now because I am not going to use this for anything. So then I click create and boom, here we are. Now that we have our server, the first thing we need to do is add some different things. And the first thing we are going to look at is bots. So bots are basically um, a big part of every Discord server because they help organizing things. Um, they can give away things like there's many different kinds of bots out there and we are going to go over some different kind of bots. So for that, we are just going to go to our browser, whatever it is, and then we are going to search this Discord bots and then top GG. I think this is a good website. Um, and here with me, six bot is a really good bot. We can just, you know, download this one if we, if you want that, obviously. And then we just, you can just try, go to the website or whatever website you find. And then just, you know, click on it, add to Discord. It's not that difficult. Then you just follow the steps. And then you will be able, just like I did right now, to add your bot to the server. And then you just click on continue. And here you can basically choose whatever, um, whatever kind of things the bot can do. But you can change that afterwards too. So I'm just gonna say, go on. And, um, and now it says I have to verify my email. I'm gonna do that real quick. That's unfortunate. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I have verified my email now. Um, so we're gonna try again. And then we are just gonna do this again. And beep, beep, boop, boop. I'm a human. Yes, I am. Oh, finally. Okay. And now we have, I guess, added the me six bot to our discord server. We can see me six just joined. And that's how you basically get the bots into your server. But I don't want to make this about installing bots and, you know, giving them access to different things. But to, you know, you can give them different settings and that stuff. If you want to do that, I mean, obviously you want to do that, 
watch another tutorial maybe i'm gonna do a tutorial on that but right now we will focus on the server creation process nice thing i want to say with the bots is there are some different bots i recommend you and that is the me6 bot that we just downloaded it's really great um, it has a lot of awesome features you definitely need then i wanted to tell you the rhythm bot is really good too it allows users to play music and that stuff and it's always great to have in your discord because people are going to spend time there and it has some different you know systems too then uh, another one you can add is dank memer and one you especially need for this nft thingy is invite tracker i think it's called invite tracker yeah invite tracker you definitely want that too because with that you can see like who invited who and if you are doing like some giveaways then this would be great and of course you can add a giveaway bot too that basically chooses a random winner and that stuff you know you can basically add a bot of everything you need so if you need something in your discord just search it up and there might be a bot for it enough with the bots now we are going to continue with the channels as you can see on the side here we have some different channels um, both text channels and voice channels and there are a lot of different channels you definitely need for your discord server when you want to have your nft discord here and want it to work well some of the most important um, channels you want to have are basically the rules um, which shows what members cannot do in your server um, then announcements and there you can just basically announce everything uh, you need to announce and then we need like some general chat and a voice chat just to you know communicate and that stuff and you can basically add infinite text chats something like memes is always good on the nft discord servers or like fan art um, and then you can add something like giveaways and yeah that's what we are going to do right now so i'm going to create some right now and then i will just finish it and you will see the finished project uh, product and also something that is really important always with your discord is the design and for that i have some different websites for you once this website it's really nice because you have a lot of different symbols and uh, numbers and emojis to pick from that you can basically um, use for your discord names like i don't call it uh, just general then you make like a cloud in front of it and call it general and yeah i'm gonna show you it later how i designed these different things and for that this website is just really great and i will link it in the video description okay so let's begin now the first channel we always uh, we can already create is in our text channels is a channel called announcement Mints. just do this um, and then we can click on edit the channel and here we will um, go on the settings and there you can basically put the settings how you want to because in the rules channel you obviously don't want any people to write something in so we're gonna just cross out that that says um, writing messages and you know here you can just edit it so that it works and yeah so basically the announcement channel is only for the mods and now it just looks really pale so we are gonna add like an emoji um, and I'm just gonna do this for demonstration purposes so I will just go over here then you can like look what emoji you want for announcements and then you can basically just copy and paste that over to your discord server just like that and boom save escape and you got a nice emoji in there and i'm gonna just create some different channels now and design them and then i will show you guys what i did and um 
show you how I did it. Okay guys, as you can see, I have now designed the Discord and yeah, I think it looks pretty good. Um, added some different things such as announcement, rules, general chat, chill voice, and you know, these different things I just added um, are really important to have. So make sure to have that too in your Discord. Okay, now I want to show you guys with the service stats here, it's something special um, because this is not a normal Discord service. I've seen this in a lot of NFT service though. This is like some locked voice channels and they're just locked. Nobody can write in them, at, at be in them. And it's just to have some basic information such as launch November 20th or something or best server or uh, people, you know, the people counter how many um, members there are um, and yeah that's just to have some basic information up there make also sure to you know edit the channel settings um, because um, it might be that you want a section only for admins and that stuff and you can pretty easily you know edit the settings and um, make a voice chat for admins only for example and you know, the thing that is really important is that you have to have these permissions right because you don't want anybody from the general chat to be in the admin chat and that stuff. And that's ev basically everything you can edit in the um, server settings. So make sure to check that out and you know read everything through firmly to know what you're dealing with. and. I have a suggestion for you too, because I see this on a lot of Discord servers that um, people, when they rank up through the me six spot, that they get more permissions to different kind of chats. And I think that's a great way to keep uh, your Discord members active and you know, um, stay in the community. Also, you want your admins, you know, be able to like ban people, mute people, and you know have the right settings to do different kinds of things um, otherwise your whole discord is going to collapse and it's not gonna work um, and yeah these nft servers um, there are some people too that you know don't behave well and you don't want it on your server and so now the last thing to do is uh, to decorate uh, the general server we have decorated our chats now um, but there's a couple other things to do, you can do. Um, the first thing you can do is, you know, go to your server settings to add a server icon. And the server icon is really important because that's the first thing um, your users are going or members are going to see. Um, so uh, as you can see here uh, with all the discords I'm in, they have like some really nice designs and I really recommend you putting a bit of effort into that because um, 
you know how it looks is basically has an influence on your members then another thing you can add is a server banner it would appear here um, but that uh, you need level one nitro on your server for that and it's not really necessary either um, and you know these different things just make your server look way better and yeah I will maybe make a video about this too um, where I tell you guys how to market your server you know and get it out there um, we will see but if you enjoyed this video make sure to hit a thumbs up and subscribe and with that said I will see you in the next video bye